Hello everyone, my name is Mia Easyley and welcome to Mia Reacts to Pokemon Presents. Um, it is a fabulous day because it is August 3rd and a new Pokemon Presents has come out. Um, these are my hopes for the Presents before I watch it, which is I would like to see a lot of stuff about Scarlet and Violet. I want to see the final evolutions. I would like them to announce that Pokemon Unite has been um, discontinued and it's gone forever. Um, and they're replacing it with um, bringing N64 games and GameCube Pokemon games to the Nintendo Switch. So that's my fingers crossed moment. Um, but I'm just a girl with a fantasy. So let's just get right into this. Um, and thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do whatever. No one cares. Let's watch this Pokemon show and see what happens. Hello everyone, I'm Hi. Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. In today's Pokemon Presents, we will be sharing information on several of they our really games, know how to set this including up. the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. But before that, I'm happy to share some news about the Pokemon World Championships that will be held in London, UK this year from August 18th to August 20th. He is a very attractive gentleman. Please have Wait, a look at Wait, these new starter in the background? <gasps> Hello Pokemon Trainers, I'm Chris Brown from the Pokemon Company International, and I'm delighted to share with you updates on our annual Pokemon World Championships. After three years, our every global time, community every time will come he comes together out, can we August 18th the to 21st Sept in months? London for not only intense Pokemon battles, but also to be together, celebrating old friendships and creating new ones, all in the spirit of friendly competition. We are expecting thousands of players from around the world to compete in this year's trading card game, video game, and Pokémon Tournament Deluxe events. Many players had long journeys earning their reputation the over several plush. years, and we are thrilled to learn who will earn the title of World Champion in 2022. This year, we are also adding many new elements to the show, beginning with two new Pokémon titles. Please join me in welcoming Pokémon Go, where nearly 100 players will compete across two age divisions, and Pokémon Unite, where 16 I... teams from 11 regions will compete. These players have battled all year for their shot to earn the title of the very first world champion in these new categories. <laughs> no one we cares. also have a few surprises in store for fans attending in person, keep including our largest ever throat. Pokemon Center World's Pop-Up Shop. For those unable what? to attend in person, you can follow all the action from wherever you are on our dedicated live streams for each product. I want Pop-Up Shop. Including coverage uh, did you guys see that fossil thing? Match for each age division. Pokemon tournaments are held around the world. And also we got my hope nails the done. competition at the World Championships inspire many new players to make new friends through battles. I would love to do like and an one actual more thing. like drag. It's Pokemon my honor fight. to unveil for fans today our new Pokemon World Championships Pikachu trophy. Take a look. This is a lot of hype music for like a little mouse on a stand. Thank you. We look forward to seeing you in London, and now I would like to hand it back to Mr. Utsu Nomiya. Okay, Thirsty Septiles. Oh my God. Thank you very much, Mr. Brown. Do you think he knows he's With this With the Pokemon hot? World Championships returning after three years, please look forward to exciting battles to keep you on the edge of your seats. I'm on the edge of my now, seat. I'd like to share some news about a few of our games. Scarlet and Violet. Stop talking about Unite! For the first time in three years, we held in-person Pokemon Go Fest events in Berlin and Seattle. And this weekend, we will be holding an event in this. Sapporo, Japan. Mysterious I know there's, I know creatures there's a little echo, I, I don't have headphones. have appeared at each event. And these Ultra Beasts will all gather together during the Pokemon Go Fest 2022 finale event. It will be held I on just August can't. 27. The finale just, is a global event note, that can be enjoyed by trainers wherever they you, are like, in the world. I don't want to like trainers sound like I'm definitely like, like I think I'm better Pokemon than anyone. They I never feel that. But like, it really drives me a little nuts that like, it can really also encounter the that, mythical like, Pokemon Shaman by completing I'll be somewhere and I'll have a Pokemon research. shirt on and some random will be lady will just be like, contend with you the like Pokemon? And I'll be like, and what has a little obsessed, yeah, as I have like an entire leg of Pokemon tattoos. And I stream Stay Pokemon tuned for full the time. story's conclusion. And she'll be like, do you like the Pokemon Go? Additionally, I'm like, no, Daily not really. Adventure and she'll act like I spit in her face. And I was like, name a, a Pokemon game. And she's can like, be used once a Pokemon Go. For 15 minutes. It can attract Pokemon Hi, not normally seen in your area. And rumors say it might one? even attract legendary Pokemon. 
Use daily adventure Honey, track insets for a 15 minute adventure reasons. every day. Over the past six years, we've seen Pokemon from every region debut in Pokemon Go. There are now over 700 Pokemon. It's okay if you like Pokemon Go to too. It's just not my. I mean, Whether I still play it. Whether you're making new friends like, at Pokemon Go Fest or having heated nuts. battles at the Pokemon I think World it's Championships, Niantic, it's just such the a, like, entire ooh, world yeah. is the stage for Pokemon Go, and our adventures are just getting I started. I picture it as a Pokemon treat more than a Pokemon game. Ooh. Pokemon Unite, the hot app for Nintendo Switch and mobile devices. I want, wish they had costumes in the actual Pokemon games. Unite Why did they go so crazy for this? Pokemon Unite has since its release one year ago. In celebration of its first anniversary, we're adding not only new Pokemon and features to the game, but also many events and campaigns. A new type of quick battle, Pika Party, will begin today, August 3rd. In this special type of quick battle in celebration of our first anniversary, all Pokemon on the field, both wild and players, are Pikachu. We hope you join in the festivities. What is this? Additionally, Buzzwool will be joining Unite Battles starting today, August 3rd. Oh, good. That's what everybody Buzzwool wanted. The super buff bug Pokemon. Pokemon and launch them into the air. Run amok in battle with Buzzwool's ability, Beast Boost, which temporarily increases Thank you, Buzzwool's movement speed and basic attack speed each time it knocks out an opposing Pokemon. This first anniversary is Why just is Bug the Daddy getting like come, announced like it's the greatest thing ever? We're planning more events for September as well, so please stay tuned. I wonder who they'll bring. And we're gifting you night licenses and Not that, they should have Pikachu, a thing where they release that Pikachu. Mario, Blastoise, Where's the chunky Snorlax, Pikachu? and Sylveon in celebration of the first anniversary. It's probably going to be Altaria. If Altaria's not already in it, I guarantee you I think Altaria will get put in. Maybe Milotic. What's this? Oh, it's Master ZX. Is that like in like Johto when we go up the mountain? Hey. Yeah. Mm hmm. I've never played Pokemon. I've never played this game. Oh, that makes sense. But is that supposed to be the red battle on top of Mount Silver? I imagine. Is this another? I think this is another ripoff game. I'm not sure. Also, happy 11 months, Chaos. Thank you, Triton. Thank you, everybody, for the sub. Get to the point. I mean, Gus was in it, so I mean, a Wooga, I guess, yeah. What's this? Looks like I Mewtwo's thought it was gonna be Let's Go Jodo. Why is Mewtwo in Pokemon Cafe? He hates people. Why Make is he gonna want to cook? Make and dishes with your cafe staff to treat Mewtwo to a wonderful time. Once you make a lot of delicious drinks and dishes in one minute cooking to fill Mewtwo up, it can join your staff. Don't do this to me. Mewtwo is supposed to be the perfect genetic Pokemon, and you're putting him in an play apron. Here's some kids cooking puzzle mode to satisfy Mewtwo. Tip one. Mewtwo likes gather murder and revenge. Staff. Mewtwo likes to order small plates, so gather staff that specialize in small plates. Pikachu, Squirtle, the five-star chef Victini, and the He's newly arrived hungry. Latias are good at those orders. If you want to aim for the high score, try raising I just, your Pokemon. The fact that like Victini and like go to the Pokemon menu to start I get it. I just like why are you putting legendaries in Once this? your great staff is up to the challenge, it's time to begin one minute cooking. On to the second tip. <laughs> just keep like, on I literally go Mewtwo likes murder and revenge. It goes Mewtwo likes Once to order small plates. I feel like and I can't argue with this Pokemon voice. Rack up they don't combos. give a fuck what I'm doing. Use these tips and make delicious drinks and dishes. Yes, to eat in between murders. And you murders. should be able to satisfy Mewtwo. We hope you'll give one minute cooking a try. And there's more. Following Latias, who just Satisfying appeared today, in one minute, not Latias me. will also appear in the future. Wait, there's even more. We have a special campaign underway. But wait, there's even today. more. This is your chance to get Victini and Latias <laughs> on your staff. Pokemon Cafe Remix is available at no cost to start and is playable on Nintendo Switch systems and mobile devices. <gasps> Oh, 
I'm trying Next not up, to like Fukuoka an more, and it's Pokemon just happening. Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. Trailer does not reflect actual gameplay experience. The on-screen text and voiceovers are not present in the game. <gasps> okay, Arcanine, dearly. Oh, Sawbuck! Houndor? Okay, what is that? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Is that Wooper? Don't you do this to me. Don't you dare. There's a Wooper variant? Attention, please. Today, we begin the treasure hunt. Get back to Wooper! Travel across Paldea. I hope these are done sparse. I heard this is done sparse. Get spars. to know the region. Oh. Mary! Okay. More Wooper! Quag! I wanna quag! I wanna choke! Nature. Fuck the nature! Get to the Wooper! The rich culture. The Pokemon. Sunflower's gotta be in the game too. Hi, Ko! And the people. Okay, okay. Where will you oh, go? Oh damn! They really went in. Who what is this bike meet? thing, though? Daddy. What will you achieve? What's that? With you will be your Pokemon. Journey together. Oh, I do not like the way that. Spaghetti runs. Grow together. Do they show the Tonks evolution? Fine. So Wait. Sorry, I know, I know. Oh, it was Find a regular gold dust. Okay. Treasure. I think it was. This getting real gay. I'm sorry, I can give them diamonds and crowns. Let the treasure hunt begin. We're now starting to get a clearer picture of your adventures to come in the Paldea region. I'd like to dive a little deeper into the information presented, so let's take a closer look together, shall we? The newest titles in the Pokémon series are the Pokémon Scarlet and Pokémon Violet games. These titles will be open-world RPGs, a first for the Pokémon series. Sprawling landscapes and vibrant towns weave together to form the Paldea region, where your new adventure will unfold. These are the legendary Pokémon, Koridon and Miraidon. You'll rely on one of them as a partner in your adventure. Climb on! And together you'll dash across grassy fields, move across That's water, dumb. and glide through the sky. Your partner can change forms as needed while you explore every nook and cranny of the region with them. You will be enrolling at a certain academy as a student. And a special independent study project awaits you. The treasure hunt. I Through it, you'll theme. embark on a journey to, to find student. treasure of your own here in Paldea. I to Three do grand stories are waiting for you. <laughs> One story game. will revolve around the familiar gym battles. You'll go to eight Pokemon gyms and aim for the champion rank. In these games, there is no set path you must take when challenging the gyms. Chart your very own course like along Oblivion Victory Skyrim Road. Pokemon? What the fuck is that? The other two stories you'll oh, experience ice. 
hold many surprises and discoveries as well. Which story will you begin with? Give me answers. How will you progress through them? It is all up to you. There's three storylines. I want the Pokemon. I don't care about the people. Professor Sada and Professor yes, Churro. You. Research legends passed on in the Paldea region. Mr. Clavel is the director of the academy you'll attend. And Mr. Jacques is your homeroom teacher who teaches biology. Okay, Mr. Jacques you'll is everything. You'll have your battle-loving friend, Nimona. And you'll meet Arvin, an upperclassman and a great cook. Arvin has a There's secret. There's also Penny, a shy student in your grade. There are gym I'm leaders, Penny. too. Like Grusha, the ice-type gym leader. The people you meet in Paldea are sure to enrich your adventures. Many different species of Pokémon also call the Paldea region home. This Pokémon is the Paldean regional form of Wooper. It lives on the land and covers its body with a poisonous film. It has bones. Fido are delightfully squishy Pokémon that are smooth to the touch. And here's Satitan, which has a large body and a hard horn that can freeze its surroundings. Fido. Of course, we also have the Pokémon from which you'll choose your first partner. Sprigatito, Fuecoco, uh -huh. Judy, and Quaxley. Queer duck. Enjoy meeting lots of Pokémon. And complete your Pokédex as part of your adventure. The top? I don't even know By what using expect. the Union Circle, you can enjoy co-op play with up to three friends. You I can go look for Pokémon you haven't yet discovered. And go go to Or even ride together to race across the map. You can't get go Enjoy all the Paldea region has to offer with family and friends. Oh, this looks really the nice. The terrestrial phenomenon makes Pokemon shine like gems. It doesn't do anything. It just makes them pretty. Oh. Jewel, love it. All Pokemon in the Paldea region are able to terrestrialize, which can provide a boost to a Pokemon's type and make its moves stronger. Some Pokemon will change type when they terrestrialize. What type they become seems to depend on that Pokemon's Terra type. This is gonna add a lot. For example, an Eevee would typically remain normal type after terrestrializing, but there could be Eevee that become grass or water type after terrestrializing. It's we like hope you'll try power. to catch Pokemon with rare Terra types. There's going to be a Crystal Onyx then. Is Onyx in this game? Pokemon that have rare Terra types are more likely to appear in Terra raid battles. You can challenge Terra Pokemon in these battles with up to three other trainers. This is a new kind of raid battle where you can attack or heal with your own timing without having to wait for your allies. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> Try to cooperate with your allies to get the upper hand in these battles. I'm not a team player. I'm a leader, but I'm not a team player. After you successfully defeat a Terra Pokemon, you'll get the opportunity to catch it for yourself. Am I going to have to change the theme? I was going to do a playthrough that was musicals, or I was going to do a playthrough that was like... For the name of, Am I going to just have to do a Jules theme? I do love Crystal. Don Fan! We've kept all the things you love about Pokemon while evolving the adventure you can have in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. I would love to use a Scizor, but I, there's so many new Pokemon. We hope you look forward to the day you set out on I your adventure. Uber. I want Lechonk. The Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games are available to pre-order at participating Did they just say the evolving the, the adventure? What Pokemon does everyone want to see? Early purchase, receive a special Pikachu. Knows Your independent flies, study in the Paldea okay. region begins in three months. We eagerly await your enrollment. That's all for today's presentation.
Thank you very much for tuning in and watching. Thank you. Oh my god. Okay. Um all right, let's um let's check the Pokemon website. Okay, everybody, we're gonna look through stuff. Um, I wanna know what Pokemon do everyone wanna see? I saw Garboder, I saw Electros, I saw Beedrill. Um, what does everyone wanna be that what, what everyone wants to see? I'm pretty happy with what we saw so far, because I did want Go Go to get some attention. I'm happy just to see anything Gen 2, so Mary, stuff like that, etc. I'm liking what I'm seeing. I'm liking the open world thing. That bike thing is stupid. Uh, the raid part looks kind of dumb. I'm open to the multiplayer, and I can't wait for Kara and I to play this. Also, I'm kind of here for this, like, idea of, um... I'm kind of here for this idea of, uh... What's the word? Of the crystallizing thing. It kind of reminds me of Megas, but, like, they're pretty and sparkly. Okay, the whoopers everything. Let's take a look at them. Um, we're gonna start with... Let's look at, uh... So Titan? So Titan is an ice type. It's a Terra Whale. I think this is a single form Pokemon. It has thick fat. It's very heavy. Um, so Titan needs to have tough muscles to be able to support the immense body. I <laughs> understand that. And physical attacks using their body have incredible power. They also migrate around the snowy regions, protected by a thick layer of, um, I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna try to say that word, fat. Uh, the horn on the upper jaw freezes the surroundings. Since Titan has five hard horns, among them the horn in the upper jaw is about able to gather ice energy. Y'all, um, rate it, scale out of one, one out of ten. What do we think of this Pokemon? Making the surroundings temperature extremely low and freezing the area around the Pokemon. It's a single form ice type. I like the, to my understanding, I could be wrong. Um, let's see, let's see. A lot of five, six point five, seven. I'd give it a good six. It looks fun. I don't really like using single form Pokemon because they get a little good at a nine. All right, so it's a, it's a good Pokemon. It's not the best so far. Okay. That's the Titan. Let's take a look at... We got... So we only got three things announced, realistically. Let's go to Fido. Um, Fido's a fairy type. Oh, look at it. It's baked. Okay, what do we think of um, Fido as I read it off? The puppy Pokemon. It's a fairy type Pokemon. It's only 24 pounds. It's got to evolve. It has to. It has to fucking evolve. I'm just glad it's not a normal type. Um, this Pokemon has moist, <laughs> this Pokemon has a moist, smooth feeling to it. A scale out of 1 of 10, Ty T says 12, Arya says 11. Do we want this on my team? I mean, I could literally do LeChonk, because they're bacon. Like, they're baking. They're, they're baked. Um, Spiritito as the weed cat. Fido as the, like, baked dog. I was gonna do, like, and if it's a school theme, could you imagine this whole, like, kind of, like, like, the kid, the, the kid that didn't listen to Dare? You know what I mean? Like, all completely, and I, I don't want to push anything on anybody, but, like, I'm kind of here for it. <laughs> Fido has to be on my team or you're unfollowing. Okay. <laughs> Fido's moist, smooth skin has elastic qualities, and it's both firm and soft at the same time. <laughs> oh, me too, gentlemen. Um... When these Pokemon become excited, they intimidate their opponents by puffing up their bodies to appear bigger and, like, dough rising. I'm gonna fucking cry. <laughs> its breath contains useful yeast. Um, Fido ferments things in its vicinity using the yeast in its breath. Said yeast is useful for cooking, so this Pokemon has been protected for people by people since long ago. I'm definitely not gonna puff puff pass on this one. I love Fido. Fido's definitely... Number one choice for team right now, besides Lechonk. Lechonk, Fido, I think I'm going to go with Sprigatito. And um, I did notice somebody else I would like on the team. So that gives me a normal, a fairy, and then grass. And I mean, I've heard rumors of Sprigatito's final evolution. We're not going to go over that. I don't think I'm going to get Palmy, and I don't think I'm going to get Small Live. Um, but let's take a look at Paldian Wooper. Okay. Um, Wooper, a poison fish. It's poison and ground. Okay, water ground, so it loses its water. That's fine. Poison ground is good. It's weak to psychic. It's weak to... Um, I don't know if it was, it's resistant to ground because ground resists or not, but we'll, I'll find out. Uh, it's weak to water, which is a little sad because it used to be a water type, but that's fine. Um, I like this a lot. I like how spooky it is. I like the little bone side. Let's read it. 
They live on the land and cover their bodies with a poisonous film. In ancient times, Wooper lived underwater in the Paldia region, but it seems after losing its struggle for territory, they began living in bogs on land. To keep from drying out while living on land, they began to cover their bodies with poisonous film. Also, ground type Pokemon are really good. Right out of one out of ten, everybody. Um, uh, Wooper is uh, ground is a really good type. It's it's ice, rock, and bug that usually get the most like effed over. So I would be very excited to use. Uh, people are rating this 100. Come on. <laughs> um, how do you love Nuzlocke an open world game? I have no idea, Cloud. I, I don't have any plans to Nuzlocke this. Um, we'll find out after my first playthrough. It still gets water absorb? It still gets water absorb. It doesn't have a water weakness. I wonder if it has a hidden ability or if that's its hidden ability. Powerful, po power, po powerful, poisonous liquid emits from their tough gills. Uh, w these warbler girls have hardened thanks to living on land for so long. Their bodies are heavy and they move slowly, but they can protect themselves by shooting poisonous, powerful liquids from their gills. You may see poison Pokemon in areas where these loopers live. It's a skull and crossbones. I'm going to hold it in. I'm not gonna start crying. <laughs> but I am definitely quagging over this Pokemon. Jolly Roger is gonna be their name. I love it. I think Sprigatito, Lechonk, Poison Wooper, and Fido. Okay, so I have four members of the team. I know we get these early. I don't know if I want to use a legendary on the team. Because I don't know if they... They look like Spiral the Dragon characters. I, I... They're nice, but I'm not, like, here for them. I also haven't been impressed by legendaries from Pokemon for a little bit. And that's okay. I'm very excited to see what Quagsire looks like. But! Um... Let me know what you think, everybody. Thank you for watching my Mia Reacts video. Um, so catch me out live on Twitch. Uh, this video will get posted later today, but, um, does everyone want to play a little Pokemon Crystal and, um, start to shiny, shiny Lugia? Um, uh, but before I go, please, um, do not forget you are gorgeous, stunning, glamorous, and amazing. Have an amazing night. Do not forget you are stunning. And thank you for joining today. Um, please catch me live on Twitch. And, uh, thank you again for watching. And happy Pokemon Presents Day! I'm very excited. Let me know. Let me know which one you're most excited for. I'm going to have to go with my favorite thing today. Let's do favorites and least favorites before we go. My favorite thing today, Paldi and Wooper. My least favorite thing today, Hot Wheels, Power Ranger, Transformers. Thank you for watching.